welcome back to my channel. Today I want to teach you guys my top three stretches for opening up your shoulders. Before we get started, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the bell so you never miss a new upload. So having rounded forward shoulders is a problem that a lot of dancers suffer with. So I'm going to teach you guys three stretches that I really enjoy myself that help me open up my shoulders. Now I want you to all remember that while having tight pectoral muscles is definitely a cause of having that rounded forward shoulder posture, you can also have an imbalance between the strength and the flexibility. So working on strengthening up the back of the shoulders and holding your muscles from the back is also really important to develop the proper alignment and the proper posturing for ballet. But let me go ahead and show you guys the three stretches I super enjoy for stretching out and opening up my chest. First stretch, we're gonna grab a stability ball or anything that you can go ahead and lie over. And we're going to lie back on the stability ball, get your legs out in front of you, and then bring the ball down to a little lower. You want the ball to be a little bit below your shoulders here, so then you can roll your shoulders down and back, extend the neck, and open up. Now, you're going to bend those elbows in and then allow everything to open towards the ceiling. Make sure you're not allowing your shoulders to hike up, so I want you guys to pull those elbows down towards your rib cage so that you're keeping the shoulders depressed and you're opening up the front of the pectoral muscles here. So go ahead and hold this stretch up to 30 seconds to your tolerance without pain. And remember to keep those elbows in by your sides, you know, actively squeezing them. And relax. Okay, stretch activity number two. You're going to take this ball and you're going to walk it behind you. Now, again, we don't want to push ourselves into this elevated shoulder posture. We want the shoulders to be down and back. So I'm going to have you hug the ball in reverse, but keep those shoulders down. So move your hands to a lower level and you're going to push the ball and hug it, squeeze, open the shoulders, and relax. Squeeze, open the shoulders and relax, and squeeze, open the shoulders, and relax. And you can do this five to ten times to your tolerance. This next stretch, you can do it with a bar or a chair in front of you, and it's going to help for increasing shoulder extension. So we're going to place our hands up on the bar and you're going to roll the shoulders down and back like we talked about. And then I want you to keep palms down and lean forward until you feel a stretch in the front of your shoulders. And you'll feel it underneath as well. Keep those elbows straight but not hyperextended. And hold up to 30 seconds with pain-free range. slowly come out of it. Remember dancers that stretching and mobility activities are not the only thing that's going to help open up your posture and get you that port de bra that's going to look more professional and artistic and actually be healthy for your body in alignment. If you want to improve your port de bra and your upper extremity alignment and overall quality of your ballet arms, then you should definitely check out my course. The Veronica K platform has step-by-step -step courses for cross-training dancers for injury prevention and technique strengthening. I will take you through exercises and mobility activities for your upper quadrant to improve your port de bras and your alignment of the upper spine in dance. If you'd like to try three days free, click the link below in the description and it will take you there that you can try three days on me in our monthly billing and do the arms course. Don't forget to subscribe below and I'll see you next time dancers.